Time to start recording this match. Let's see if we can, uh... Let's see if we can, uh... Have a good one. Alright. They're gonna take down mid first, which is cool. They're not a super split push team, and that's okay. They're now splitting off pretty much evenly, but they're going after mostly the, uh... Light blue, so I'm gonna head toward dark blue. That guy was like lagging so much, holy crap. Oh darn, we've only got two kills. This shit's wild. Ah, looks bad. Their situation is looking bad. The situation's looking grim. But I guess this is what higher high level PvP looks like. It gets pretty wild. Cause everybody's strong, everybody's got stats. Hmm. <laughs> that guy was strong. Okay, I can't beat these guys head on. So we're gonna have to play tactical if we can. Some of these guys are seriously cashed up. So this ain't exactly gonna be a fun match. Oof. I even I recognize a lot of the strong ones. Yeah, and after hitting me with seeping bile, I'm kind of doomed. Shite. Gonna back off and heal. I'm gonna have to play this one hella smart. I'm basically just going to be the support. Okay, we picked up seven kills. Now, if you can't get kills by yourself, that's totally okay. Alright, there's nothing wrong with playing support. But there are people who are going to whip your ass, so even if you end up playing support, you may not increase your team's kills by that much. That's okay, but that's just how it is. So you gotta, like when you when you meet the serious cash players and stuff, just play to the best of your abilities, support your team as best you can, right? That's all you can really do. Let them do their hardcore thing. Evade their little... Basically be smart. Heal whenever you can. And then, as soon as you're capable... Get in there. If they move up, I move up.
Damn. Yeah, go wizards. Blast them. Blast them. Okay, we've got 17 kills. Now, we're not winning this, I reckon. But this is probably a good match to show an example of how when you meet somebody stronger than you and you can't really do much, the best way is to just try and support your team as best you can and just focus on that. Okay, we got right, right flank problems. Okay, now we need to go back to the other side again. And this is gonna be this kind of struggle. Rock got me. These guys are damn good. Like obviously they are gonna win, but you know, like I said, we can't we can't just let them win easy. So we gotta we gotta keep pushing both sides. And the only way to ever do this proper. is to just go ham and when and when we stop them This is legit all we can do. We're at 31 now. Okay, we gotta help right. If we can hold for 30 more seconds, we might actually win. So, 30 more seconds, that's all. Damn it, I tried. But hopefully I can buy them 10 more seconds. They just need to hold it 10 more seconds, that's all. Hold it. Hold the line. Hold the line! We won. Holy shit. We won. This was the closest victory ever. Damn. Damn, we were outmatched and we won. So you know what? They can suck it. <laughs> See, this is why it's important that even though you're losing in 1v1s, don't try and 1v1 the enemy. Do the right thing by becoming the support of your team. Do your... Do your... Uh, do your pushes things like that that's the real way to win all right so thank you guys for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe now the stream will carry on but for videos like share and subscribe okay this is my pvp match all right for more of my sick matches keep following my youtube